Hey guys, I'm Nicholas Live and this is a cryptocurrency heat map. It's an amazing website I ran into called coin360.io and it is not a replacement for a coin market cap but it shows you everything in a whole new perspective and gives you a vivid outlook on how the market looks right now. You guys see right here we have Bitcoin in the last 24 hours. Now that's based of US dollars. So it um, rose 6% in the USD price in the last 24 hours and it holds a good 44% of the whole market and that's represented by this big square. Of course, Ethereum holds a good 16% of the whole market and that's it's proportional to the whole market, right? So when you guys look at this heat map, it shows you how the whole market is doing and it gives you a perspective of what's important and what's not important. This coin right here that's red, nobody cares. But if you look at the whole market if, and if you're trying to get a feel of where the market's going right now, it's an amazing website. And not only that, but um, a bigger jump in percentage wise is a darker green. You know, this is a lighter green because it only rose, you know, three or four percent, right? So it's just very, very nice and vivid outlook for your eyes. If you guys want to look at this um, market stage right now, and if you guys want to use the filters I'm using right now, we have um, one day performance and I removed Tether because Tether is always a dollar and it just confuses you and it's a really big square and nice, a nice couple of percent on the whole market cap, right? So um, if you guys look at a one month performance, you will be surprised and it's a good thing to keep a track of, right? Look at this right here. Boom! Everything is dark red. So that looks horrible, but it shows you how things look in perspective and what's important. This little coin right here that jumped, let's see what it is. We have um, Yash coin. I've honestly never heard of this and it rose 48%. I'm not going to comment on it, but that's not important. Uh, this BTC right here, it, it lost 20% of its value in the last one month. So it, these are some pretty cool filters. It's something you can definitely play around with. If you look at one hour performance, you know, it's it's a light shade of green because, you know, you can't only go up so much in one hour. But if you look at, you know, back to the one day performance, it's it's way more realistic outlook. And it's a good way to keep track of the market and the trends if you're interested in that. Um, by no means is this replacement for CoinMarketCap, but it's a good site to check alongside with it and play around with these filters to get, uh, to get, you know, specific outlooks or specific coins, specific groups. You can group these by um, different market caps, of course. You can group, uh, remove or add, um, just remove specific coins that you, you think are, you know, not, not helping. So if you remove Bitcoin right now, it's going to be a whole different look. If we remove Ethereum, boom. Now, we, now we're looking at, you know, most of the market that's not represented by Bitcoin and Ethereum. And of course, Bitcoin and Ethereum are gatekeepers right now. Bitcoin more so than Ethereum itself. But you got to keep in mind, Bitcoin represents the entryway into the whole cryptocurrency. And Ethereum represents almost half of the cryptocurrency because there's a lot and almost half of the, of the top 100 list right now is actual ERC-20s. So it's really, really important to look at this picture in perspective. If you look at the right side of coin market cap, you'll see a list of percentages, but it's not in perspective at all. Anyway, if you guys like this website, you should definitely check it out. I'm not affiliated with them. I just ran into this website and I thought it's really cool for you guys to check out yourself. Coin360.io. I love this view. It's not the most practical website, but it puts things very vividly for you to understand and just see how things are happening. Anyway, you guys are awesome and I'll see you later.